medicine. I'm surprised to see you here. What can I do for you? Don't talk down to me, Lyons. I had nowhere else to turn. You must help us. Project Purity has been overrun. Yes, I'd heard reports of an incident there. What details can you give us? The Enclave. They've attacked Project Purity. James is dead. There may be more. I don't know. You have to do something. Then it's as we fear. Madison, I'm sorry this happened. I wish we could have done something. Then do something now. They've taken over the purifier. Lions, they cannot be permitted to have control over it. It's not right. No, no. Yeah. Calm down. You know as well as I do that the purifier See, doesn't work. It's useless to them. Perhaps it's time to walk away. That's not true. James, he found what's been missing. We know how to get it running. Is that so? Does the Enclave know this? No, I don't think... I don't know. I, d I just don't know what's happening anymore. All right, Madison, it'll be okay. Now, this is James's son, I presume? I can see the resemblance. Yes. He knows what we need. vault tech computer, something to locate equipment. Please help him. Very well. We'll sort this all out. Hail. I need to rest, lie down or something. This is just too much. Rothschild should help you, but don't forget that he's Brotherhood. I've never trusted them. Be careful what you tell them. You just managed to get yourself into all sorts of trouble, don't you? Welcome to the Citadel. Not many civilians get to see the place. I've read the reports, seen the initial scans, but I can hardly believe it. I figured those radio transmissions were just old recordings. Never figured the Enclave would actually show up, in the flesh. But don't worry. Whatever they try, we'll be ready for it. I'll lead the Pride to knock them out tomorrow, if my father permits it. Talk to Scribe Jameson. She is our Keeper of the Scrolls. She will want to know what you have found. She spends most of her time in the Archives. You'll find them in A-Ring, near the Great Hall. Paladin Gunny instructs all Initiates in the use of Power Armor, but only after they've undergone a rigorous training regimen. Considering all that's happened, my father may grant you special permission, but you'll need to ask him yourself. It's the best of the Brotherhood, bar none. No one gets in without my say-so. In my father's name, I bid you farewell. You have my condolences. Your father was a good man. The most we can do is carry on his spirit. Live as he would have. Make our world a better place. More than anyone else, I dare say. Certainly enough to know they're the greatest threat the Capital Wasteland has ever faced. The Brotherhood of Steel has encountered the Enclave before, you see. Over 30 years ago, back in California. Then they were led by a President Richardson. Now we've got this Eden to contend with. It matters not now, as before they seek to control and destroy. All in the guise of restoring order. Your father, I fear, was just the beginning. The Brotherhood is an old organization going back to the years just after the war. We are but a part of it. What would you like to know?
Ah, no. That's the real question, isn't it? Our orders were, and are, to acquire any and all advanced technology. And we have, to the best of our abilities. But when I realized the extent of the super mutant threat, I felt it was my responsibility to aid the people in their struggle against them. Unfortunately, my superiors back west disagree with my assessment of the situation. They feel I've grown too attached to the local populace. And they're right. In any event, the Enclave's arrival changes everything. It's been over 20 years since we arrived, and we've been struggling to contain and eradicate the super mutants for nearly as long. With the arrival of the Enclave, I have a terrible feeling the super mutants are the least of our worries. The Brotherhood began on the West Coast, and exists there still. We were dispatched to this location many years ago. In truth, the Brotherhood of Steel has been struggling for years, both here and back home. Honor, truth, courage. These virtues seem to have little meaning in these troubled times, I'm afraid. So be it. Hmm, considering the circumstances, I think it would be prudent if you received such training, yes. Speak to Gunny in the Bailey. He will train you in the proper use of power armor. Fear not, I will send word that I have given my approval. You'll find him in the Bailey, I will send word that I have given my approval. Would you believe no? It's pathetic, really, considering we've been fighting those abominations for nearly 20 years. In all that time, all we've managed to do is to contain the threat, hold them back so they don't overrun every blasted settlement out here. But we don't really know anything. Where they're from, why they've infested the DC ruins. And now here we are, holed up in our citadel. Low on resources, low on troops. It's enough to make an old man so very tired. Of course. May I start by saying that I am sorry for your loss. I was acquainted with your father many years ago. The world has lost one of its few remaining visionaries. I have been a part of the Brotherhood for many years. Enough that I was here when Project Purity first began. I did not work directly with your father. He and his team valued their independence. And I respected that. Think nothing of it. Now, Dr. Lee has explained your predicament. You need to locate some vault tech equipment. A Gek? <laughs> Goodness no, certainly not. I must say that there are some who doubt such a device really exists, let alone works. 
If, however, you share your father's determination, I may be able to assist you in locating one. Possibly. I'm afraid I won't be able to assist you directly. The news Dr. Lee has brought will require me to be elsewhere. I can, however, give you access to an old pre-war computer from vault -Tec. It may have the information you need. You'll find the terminal in the archives in the A-Ring. You are welcome. If you require further assistance, I may be able to help. I have those results you asked for. I sent them over to your station. Welcome. The elders sent word of your arrival. I am Scribe Peabody. Welcome, etc. Now, I'm really very busy. Is there something you needed? Indeed I can. Pay no heed to those headstrong knights with their pop guns and bravado. It is the scribes, the scribes who make the Brotherhood what it truly is. The brawn is useless without the brain, hmm? <laughs> Each order of scribes is dedicated to a unique field, all equally important, all more important than those dim-witted grunts. Order of the Sword, Order of the Shield, Order of the Quill, Weapons, Defenses, and Research, respectively. Sword, of course. Weapons, my boy. You name it, I've helped someone kill it. I'm the proctor of the Order of the Sword, you see. Weapons research, development and maintenance, all my responsibility. Let me know if you need something else. So they have plasma weapons. Bah! It's strong technology, I'll give you that, but limited in modability. I've already started removing the compensators on our laser weapons to cut through the Black Devil power armor of theirs. We'll drop them like any other meat, don't you worry. I'm sure Gunny could train you, but he won't. Not without permission from Elder Lyons. You should ask him. He's usually near the lab. Until next time. Quartermaster Durga here, stranger. I have to say, I'm not sure what you're doing in my armory. We run a tight ship, and unless Elder Lion says so, we don't trade with outsiders. Quartermaster out. What's the situation? Enclave troops have fortified the Purifier complex. With those vertebrates, they're able to transport personnel at a remarkable rate. I see. Well, what's your tactical appraisal of our situation? There's been another behemoth sighted in the wasteland in the Evergreen Mills region. That's heavy raider country, so things could get interesting. Very well. Thank you for the update. All right, all right. I'll see what I can do. The Brotherhood is at your service. Yes? This is not normally something that we do. Trade with outsiders has proven to be problematic in the past. However, considering the circumstances, so be it. I'll send word to Durga that you have full access to trade. Of course. I received word from Elder Lyons. 
He says that you have permission to trade with us. Good for you. Sure, just be quick about it. Don't forget to sign out. Steel be with you. What's the situation? Hey, let me ask you something. troops have fortified the what purifier complex. What's your tactical assessment of this new uh, situation? You're kidding me, right? Tin soldiers in devil suits? And you lose your nerve? Those enclave troops are a joke. Yeah. You honor us with your presence here. Hail, Outsider. I am Scribe Jameson. Word of your ordeal has spread. I am truly sorry for the loss of your father. But if I can help you in any way, please let me know. Quite a few. But most are distinctly unladylike and unworthy of discussion. I will tell you that the Brotherhood has encountered the Enclave before and their motives were just as sinister then as they are now. You have? Oh my. This brings to light a sad affair for the Brotherhood, but perhaps it is something that you can assist us with. If you have the time, I have an offer for you. Good. As I'm sure you've noticed, the Brotherhood operates all over the DC ruins, often detached from the main base here at the Citadel. We are short on communication equipment, so many of the groups in the field operate as independent cells, with outstanding orders. Sometimes, I'm afraid that their missions end in their deaths. As Keeper of the Scrolls, it's my charge to write of each fallen brother's deeds. Exactly. A brother fallen in the field may have no one to carry word of his death back to me. In calmer times, we could send detachments and messengers to learn their fates. But with our manpower stretched thin, we have no such luxury. Which is why I must now ask you for your help. Each brother wears a holotag like the one you found. Should you find any of the fallen brethren in the field, I ask that you return their tags to me, so that I might record their deeds in the scrolls. Scrolls are kept by the head librarian of each Brotherhood bunker. The scrolls are a record of the Brotherhood itself. Into each scroll is written the name and deeds of each of our brothers. Battles, what technology is recovered, when he was promoted, everything. The last entry for each brother is that brother's death. It is important, as the way a man dies is just as important as the manner in which he lives. And so, each man who nobly serves the Brotherhood ascends into our history to be remembered by those who come after him. As you wish, just remember, more tags, more reward. I know how you outsiders think. Ah! One of my favorite subjects, of course. What would you like to know? We believe in technology, in the triumph of the creations of the ancients over the horrors and evils of the wasteland. 
We believe in trust. Trust in technology. Trust in our fellow brothers. Trust in our elders. Ah, and we believe in victory. Our forces have dwindled, but still we fight on. Super Mutant, Enclave, it matters not. Surrender is not an option. Elder Lions leads us. Star Paladin Cross is his Seneschal. Sentinel Lions, the Elder's daughter, commands the Lion's pride, our elite combat squad. The Paladins lead the Knights. The Knights are the core of the Brotherhood. They scour the waste to eliminate evil and recover technology. Scribe Rothschild oversees the scribes in their duties to seek knowledge and restore the technology the Brotherhood has acquired. We first arrived in the Capital Wasteland in 2255. In those first couple of years, we discovered the Citadel, Super Mutants, and Project Purity. Ah, the Purifier. What an undertaking. The work your father and his team did was amazing. The Brotherhood helped protect them, you know, at least for a little while. But we were stretched thin as it was, even back then. We had to pull our forces out. When we did, the place was overrun. I imagine that's when your father left. I... I'm sorry. I wish things had turned out differently. Very well. Well, there are a number of orders within the scribes, each dedicated to a specific area of research. Actually, I am Proctor of the Order of the Quill. I oversee the archives and library here in the Citadel. We are dedicated to preserving the history of the Brotherhood, as well as unearthing the secrets of the pre-war civilizations. We have a single field associate, Scribe Yearly. She operates out of the former Library of Congress to the Northeast. Very well. Yes. What about them? Have you? It saddens me to hear of my fallen brethren, but their names and deeds shall be records. Tell me, how many have you found? Their names shall be written into the scrolls, to be remembered forever. As for you, here's your reward. Use it well and in good health. Go with peace and knowledge. Initiate, you've got a lot of nerve to interrupt. Oh, my apologies, stranger. I thought you were one of these worthless initiates. I swear, these kids would be lost without me here to powder their asses. I am charged with the duty of turning these maggots into brothers of steel. With the threat of the Enclave, they're likely going to be pressed into service before they've taken the oath. So I've got a lot of work to do. Heard you were coming. Yeah, I can train you, but don't ask me to like it. My initiates sweat blood, and you just get a free pass? Anyway, you ready for this? Now look, to wear power armor, the first thing you need to do is relax your muscles. Let the suit do the work, okay? Now you. What aid can I offer you, outsider? Killing unarmed civilians makes me sick. Come over here. Try fighting someone who shoots back, fucking cowards. Why do you think I ride these initiates so hard? I make training hell so fighting those uglies won't be. If you'll excuse me, I need to go show these fish how to shoot straight. Ah, you're back. You need something else now. Ah, 
Well, that much I believe I can help with. Step over here for a moment. I'll show you where it is. This map shows the locations of all known vaults in the local area. Vault 87 has been highlighted for you. There. Entrance to Vault 87 will be particularly difficult for you, I'm afraid. The area is highly irradiated. Lethal levels are all around the entrance. Gaining direct access will be quite impossible. Quite simply, you don't. To attempt such a thing would be certain death for you. You share your father's determination, it seems. And in this case, you are correct. There may well be another way. Vault 87 is located very close to the site of Lamplight Caverns. It is entirely probable that the vault may be entered from within the caves. Attempts were made, but our resources are stretched thin. The radiation proved fatal and so our efforts were focused elsewhere. Perhaps you will have more success. The Brotherhood simply cannot spare the resources necessary to investigate the area. Perhaps you may be more successful. If you do find anything, Please return here so that we may decide how best to proceed. I wish we could do more, but the Brotherhood potentially faces a very pressing, very real threat in the Enclave. All of my efforts must now be devoted to assessing the threat they may pose to us. I'm sure you understand. Switches are showing green. Ambulatory systems look good. Hail to you. By the traction of hospitality and on the word of Elder Lions, I welcome you to the Citadel. I am Star Paladin Cross, Keeper of the Arm, and Seneschal to Elder Lions. And I am honored to say I was acquainted with your father. Now what may I do to help you? I did, and you as well. Long ago, I helped guard the water purifier against the super mutant horde. When your father left, I escorted the two of you to Megaton. He was... a noble man. I was saddened to hear of his passing. But from what I've heard, he died with honor. He died for you. I only pray that my own death has such meaning. And so our deeds are carried on through our sons and our daughters. Continue to remember him fondly. Continue to tell his story and continue to do his work. Through you, he shall carry on. But now I must ask you a difficult question, if I have your leave to do so. I escorted your father across the wastes. It was the best I could contribute to his efforts to restore fresh water to the people. I would like the honor of escorting you in your journey to complete his work. As a Star Paladin, I answer only to Elder Lions. He has given me leave to pursue the restoration of Project Purity, as I see fit. By aiding you in your travels, I shall fulfill that mission as best I am capable. Then I shall follow your leave and submit to your command. As James's child? I know I don't need to explain, but I am not your servant. If I do not like the path your actions take, I will return here. Now, let us go forward. Crush the Enclave and fulfill your father's mission. I need to collect my wits. 
and figure out what to do next. Excuse me. Hey, hey buddy. Hi. Yeah, so listen, thanks and all. Really great job you did there. Hell, I'm hit! My head! I'm hit! Taking fire! I'm hit! So, what's the latest report? Enclave troops have fortified the purifier fire. complex. I'm hit! With those vertebrates, they're able to transport fire. personnel at a remarkable rate. Very well. Thank you for the update. It's only a matter of time. Vigilance is necessary in this location. Be on your guard, my friend. Are you certain? Very well. I shall return to my duties at the Citadel, should you require my aid once again. Thanks for your help. We'll take any we can get. 